Hi and welcome to this free cyber panel tutorial series. In this tutorial series, I'm going to do a tutorial about how to set up cyber panel on CentOS 8 and use it to host multiple websites. And I will be using WordPress as an example. So I'll show you how you can install multiple WordPress sites. And I will also show you how you can move your website from a different panel to cyber panel if that's something that you want to do. So if you are following along with me on a Windows computer, I will do a tutorial for you as well, how to log into your server using party, how to set up SSH using PartyGen. I will do this and I will also do a different version for Linux and Mac. And I will do that example on Ubuntu. Every video in this tutorial series will be in a playlist. So I will create two different playlists. The first playlist will be specifically for people who are following along with me on a Windows computer. And the next one will be for anyone who is using Linux or Mac. So make sure you choose the right playlist and I will put the link to the playlists in the description below. If the link is not there, just remind me via the YouTube comments and I will add the links for you in the description below. So make sure you're watching these videos in a playlist because I will create short videos that follow along with each other. So they will progress on each other. So the videos will build up on each other. The things you're going to need in this cyber panel tutorial series will be Valtra. I will be using Valtra, but if you're using DigitalOcean or any VPS, you can follow along with me once you set up your server. But for me, I will be using Valtra. So if you don't have a Valtra account, you can use the affiliate link that I have in the description in the description below. And this link currently will give you a hundred dollar credit on your account. So I don't know how long the offer is going to run, but just check it out and see if it's available for you. And of course, we're going to use Cyber Panel as our free control panel. Cyber Panel comes with everything we need to run our website. And you can see it uses Open Lightspeed, which is an open source server, just like Nginx and Apache. So we're going to use Cyber Panel and then we're going to run all of this on CentOS 8. So if you come here under CentOS into the download link up here, you can see the versions of CentOS that are currently available. And we're going to use CentOS 8 for this tutorial series. If you want to follow along with a different operating system, once you set up the server for that, feel free to follow along with me. Maybe you want to use Debian or you want to use Ubuntu. You can do that as well. But for me, I'm going to use CentOS 8 and you can follow along using CentOS 8 if you want to follow along with me. So CentOS 8 end of life will be 2029. That's why I'm using CentOS 8 and CentOS 7, which is currently the most used CentOS server as we'll go up to 2024. And this one is running out this year. So you should just choose CentOS 8 and think ahead. So that's pretty much the introduction for this tutorial series. And as I said, we're going to, I'm going to put all the videos in one playlist and follow along with me if you're on Windows or if you're on Linux or on Mac. I'm going to do videos for you because there are different places like setting up SSH, logging into your server, which will be different for people on a Windows computer. And I'm going to start with Windows. As soon as I'm done with that, we can all go along with installing cyber panel. So I will see you in the next video when we deploy our first, our first server. If you don't have a Valtra account, you can go ahead and set up your account and feel free to use the affiliate link in the description, which will give you hundred dollars. I don't know how long the offer is going to run out, but you can just check it out to see if it's still available for you. So I'll see you in the next video.